Neural marketing is where neuroscience meets marketing. How does the brain chemistry change when marketing stimuli enter upon it? Some really interesting things. So what the neuroscience is telling us, what neuromarketing looks at is the fact that what we now know is that 95% of everything, every thought, every emotion, every feeling that you all have happens at a subconscious level. You're not even aware sometimes of how you feel. So sometimes when we ask customers, well, what did you think of that experience? And they go, hmm. And they look away, far away. <laughs> it's because they've never really thought about it. Now they have to articulate and put words to a feeling they didn't realize they had. And what the research tells us is that facts are easily filtered. Again, the intellectual shield goes up when we filter those. But feelings, feelings are there. Right? Feelings happen first. So what ends up happening in, in neuroscience is that seconds before the, the front here lights up and makes a decision, all the gray matter of the subconscious brain lights up. The feeling happens first, then we go to the rational part of the brain to justify the feeling. So facts are justifications for a feeling we already have. The feelings happen first. And that's what we know. So we're really only reaching about 5% of our customers' brains at any given time. Hopefully we're reaching the right 5%, but I don't think sometimes we are.